Hey guys, so welcome back to CC. So, Cupcake is just having a little bit of a nap. But I've got to wake her up for the video because otherwise I'm not really going to be able to film. Because, <laughs> yeah. Oh, you've woken up yourself. It's good. Okay. So, today's video. Oh, I've already posted a video. Yes, I'm filming. With the camera. Um, so, today's other video. Similar to the first video I did today. First video was... Was five reasons to get guinea pigs but now it's going to be five reasons to not get gu guinea pigs oh okay so there are a few reasons to not get guinea pigs so let's get in the video okay so cookie just trying to eat my camera as usual um but so first reason is they are messy I have to clean the guinea pig's cage three times a day because they're so messy. Yep, today I've just cleaned their cage, like, oh no, just a few of an hour ago and look, they've tipped out their food, grass is everywhere, everywhere, yeah, and the house is worse, but inside the tower, loads of poos, yuck. Yes, yeah, so they've made a massive mess. So you may have to clean a few times a day, like me. Uh, but I think I gave you a brief explanation about messy, as you can see. Oh, messy. <laughs> so then let's move on to the second reason. So second reason is actually I don't know after. So, well, again, I've written down all of them piece of paper my ideas for filling so I'll just go and get them guinea pigs can sometimes be picky with their food you want to give them a little bit you want to give them some cucumber because it's boiling out there they just give it a sniff and shake their head and go like no I'm not eating this thing and go off. Cookie. Cookie, she's a little rascal. But she loves everything. She'll eat whatever you give her. Cupcake, on the other hand, she doesn't like what I've tried. Tomato. She doesn't like cucumber. Uh, I don't think she likes strawberry or blueberry either. Uh, but she loves dandelions. She loves grass. Giving my two guinea pigs a lot of grasses, both of them. Uh, she loves hay and loves beef flakes and loves her muesli, guinea pig muesli. But a few things. Oh, and banana. She doesn't even like banana. Sometimes I give her a little bit of banana. But no. Shakes her head and goes and goes for a little walk around the cage. Right. Let's get on to the third reason space this is reason three space guinea pigs acquire a lot of space like hamsters like hamsters hamsters you can just live in a cage i'm not sure if i've done a video about it but i used to have a hamster called bubbles but he sadly died about a year ago passed away very sad that day. Uh, this hamster is now my friend's hamster. I'm just keeping her up, uh, keeping hamster. She's run away once or twice, I think. Uh, yeah, but we've got him in the cage now. God, is she's going to Poland for two weeks, and so we're just keeping him over here we're not really doing anything oh and he bites so we don't strike him or anything all we do is give him water and food and that's it but 
guinea pigs require a lot more than a tiny pet store cage. Require massive amounts of space. And <laughs> I think this cage is getting a little small for them. So we're getting a new cage soon. I think tomorrow. Yeah. Too small. It require a lot of amount of space. Oh, and something else I'm going to talk about while I'm here on space. If you have two, two guinea pigs, they should be both the same gender because... And if you buy two guinea pigs at the same time, that's fine. Uh, they can be baby and adult, but they must be the same gender. They can be baby, adult, they can be baby, baby, whatever you like. But if you have one guinea pig and then you find out they need a uh, guinea pigs need to have another person uh, another guinea pig with them I'll talk about in the next one because that's the next uh next thing uh but like me I, i'm not sure if i told you this story before but i had cupcake in a tiny pet store cage uh day later i found out they needed a bigger cage so i had this cage then a week later i found out that they need to be with company so they need to have someone else with them so that's when i bought cookie <laughs> just a brief explanation because i've got to go get lunch soon but next one is company i've just talked about this guinea pigs must be kept in pairs even if you're if you're with even if you're with your guinea pig 24 7 no that's no you must it's not good for guinea pigs to be on their own that's why i have cupcake and cookie and in a nice big cage now one more not all guinea pigs like to be stroked you may think guinea pigs are cuddly cute love to be stroked pets oh yes that is that is right but not all guinea pigs look like that everyone's different like cupcake who loves being stroked you'll do this kind of like purring sounds uh when when i stroke her oh i said cupcake and she's reacting to my name but anyway uh cookie she runs away when i when i even put her thing put my finger oh sorry the camera's falling i still don't have a stand when i put my finger near her, she will just run away she doesn't care now i've really got to get lunch my hand is aching man. uh yes so i'll see you guys in so i keep forgetting this part please please subscribe to my channel and click the like button because it really helps me out and i gotta go bye see you in the next video